Hello. Hello, hello, hello. I am back with some more Pokemon Y again today. Yesterday we... We sorted out the power plant, headed into Lumio City, got our fifth gym badge, and then headed on up t towards our next gym challenge. And uh, we actually picked up the fourth member of our team, little Gumi. Um, so, yeah, and then we made it to Lavia City, which is where we will be kicking off today, which is where the next gym is. There's also a bit more story stuff to do here as well. So, let's jump into the game. Let's get started. Let's get going with it. Okay, I have gone through and EV trained Gumi. I didn't quite get chance to uh, do the... Uh, affection stuff just yet so i'll do that between uh this stream and the next one but um gumi is fully ev trained as you can see from down there in special attack and defense and a little bit in hp so yeah that's what we were going for with gumi i'm just checking my team to make sure everything is in order i'm just gonna check your summary quickly i could potentially just use some rare candies on you because i think i'm pretty sure pretty certain i've got some rare candies so it might be useful to throw them on just to try and catch you up. Yeah, I have four. Catch you up in levels a bit because you are a little bit behind Gumi. So we should see the uh, special attack and uh, special defense jump up quite drastically during these little rare candy uses. Yeah, look at that. Special defense is 95 now. And here we go. Muddy water. Excellent. Um, get rid of flail. We don't need that. We have a pretty decent moveset here now with uh, a little Gumi, which is good. Obviously, um, when it becomes Gudra, we'll probably replace Muddy Water with Surf, because might as well. Okay, cool. Um, I'm just going to go in and do some reordering of movesets, because I, I, I don't like my or the orders of my movesets right now. <laughs> okay, so we need Dragon first, uh, Thunderbolt's fine second, and then probably Muddy Water, then Infestation. I, I kind of like you putting them in order of use, um... Ah, that's fine. Uh, we'll probably go this way around. Horn Leech. Put Speed Bomb last because it's kind of the next one to go. Horn Leech is slightly less power but has the added effect of healing, which is pretty good. So um, keeping that in that order. We need this first. This second, is that right? Yeah. Then like that. Cool. You're not part of the team and you're not part of the team. So your movesets do not matter to me. Okay, cool. Lavia City. Um, so first things first, we have got Mr. Bonding here. Hey! Hey, how's it going, friend? I'm Mr. Bonding, the expert on O-Powers. Let me ask you just in case. Do you need to hear an explanation about O-Powers? No. Hey, that's my friend. Let's get started, shall we? It's bonding time. Um, encounter power. Excellent. Cool. Okay. Um, encounter power increases the chances of encountering wild Pokemon can use O powers from the PSS and the more you use them the higher they level up so use them as often as possible well then I do believe I shall take my leave right about now hope to see you around cool okay I'm just gonna check the oh there's a second guy what do you sell what are you selling ah you're selling the vitamins don't need those not right now anyway maybe in the future when we uh need to do Friendship evolutions will come back and buy a load. <laughs> Potentially. Um, I'm just seeing if we've got anything that we want to sell to this guy. I don't think we do, really. Oh, no, we have got a big mushroom and a tiny mushroom. And we have a star piece. Cool. We have a little bit of money now. Um, yeah, that's all. Okay. I'm not going to bother buying anything. I don't really need anything right now. So we'll come back to that at a later point. Okay. Cool. Um... <laughs> So, there's a few things we want to grab. We want to talk to this guy. Because um, he gives you torment. And here is a tiny mushroom. <laughs> okay, let me, uh, let me go through the different things. Oh, well, too far the... Little things don't talk about grabbing the ether. So. Okay, so 
There are two people here. One guy wants to see a Pokemon that is shorter than 12 inches. And there is a girl uh, in the ca near the cafe, near in no, near the cafe, um, that wants to see a Pokemon that is taller than nine foot ten. Now I'm going to check my p PC. I don't know whether I'll be able to do the nine foot ten unless Aurorus is above nine. To be fair, Aurorus might be bigger than nine foot ten. Can I see heights on this? No, not like that. Um, let me just check Aurorus quickly. Do you have height in here, or do I have to go into the P uh, Pokedex for that? I guess I have to go Pokedex. Okay, we'll check the Pokedex to see if I have any caught Pokemon that are of the sizes we want. I think Flabebe is short. Um, I wish I could see the whole Dex in one. It'd be so much easier. Okay. Now, I have caught most Pokemon. Okay, well, there's no point checking you, is there? Um, where does it say heights? Um, where? Where's your height? Oh, it's here. Okay, you're one foot. Three foot. Four foot. Uh, one foot. Shorter than 12 inches. Is that shorter than one foot? That is right, isn't it? One foot is 12 inches, right? Or is it 13? I don't know. What Pokemon are going to be shorter than a foot tall? There are not many short Pokemon, are there? Aha! Azuril. Now, that's not what I would have expected. Okay, so we can grab an Azuril for that one. Okay, now I just need one that is above... Um, nine, nine, ten. Okay, well, let's see. Oh, uh, your Flabebe is even smaller. It's only four inches. Okay, so I have a few Pokemon that I can do for the short one. Um, okay, I'm just trying to see if... I think none of these Pokemon are going to be that tall, are they? Mm. Nine foot is very big, so... Snorlax? No, you're only six foot eleven. I say only. That's still very tall. Um, okay, so not in the... Uh, oh, that's annoying. Why did it take me out of the Pokedex? I just wanted to come back to this bit. Central Kalos, no. Coastal Kalos. Oh, what about you? Oh, 810. Because I knew that was... I knew Surviper... I, the snakes always go on the length rather than their actual height. I don't have a Whale Lord either. Whale Lord would have done it. Ah, Onyx. I have an Onyx. I forgot I had an Onyx. Okay. So, Flabebe and Onyx. Probably the easiest ones. Let's grab them quickly. Oh. My stream has broken. Okay. Bit annoying. Um, recording? You get to see this. Yeah, I'm just going to try and restart my stream. I think I broke everything. I don't know whether the recording is broken now. Okay. I don't know whether what happened there. My whole OBS just like froze. So I don't know what happened to the recording. Whether you could hear me or see anything I was doing just then. Um, but I'm just restarting the stream now. So I'm just going to wait a sec to get confirmation that it is back up and working again. It's annoying how often this happens to me. Because I was still connected to the internet. It's not like I lost the internet connection there. It just decided to break. Okay, cool. It's working. So, let us go grab the Pokemon we need. So, um, Onyx. There's a flip baby. Okay, we'll grab our uh, Pokemon back in a sec. Okay, so a uh, guy near the southeast gate would like to see a Pokemon that is short. Yes, I do. Gumi. Oh, I, Gumi is short too, apparently. 
Fair enough. I didn't even need to get for the baby. Oh well. That's fine. But to be fair, it might, it might say Aurora's as well in a sec when we go talk to the girl near the cafe, which I think the cafe is up this way. I think it's this girl. No, nope. this girl. No, okay. Aurora's isn't that tall, but Onyx definitely is. Cool, okay. You can do that daily as well, which is weird. If you want to stock up on Puka Dolls. Which I guess can be quite useful because they can just let you run away from things, but... It's probably better off just getting a smoke ball, to be honest. Um... Come here, Gumby. Okay, cool. Let's keep heading on around the different areas. There's a Pokemon fan club around here somewhere, apparently. I'm assuming it's going to be signposted. I should probably get my uh, Dowser machine out so I can... I... Is there not an item in the... Well... I guess not. Gengarite from this person? How do I know where the fan club is? Northwest. Is that up this way then? No. Okay, it must be one of these two buildings. It's just not signposted. <laughs> this guy. The other fan club guy? Greetings, greetings. Yes, he is there. He gives an effort ribbon basically to your lead Pokemon if it has max EVs. I could technically do this for all my Pokemon because they're all max EV'd but I don't need to. Okay. Um, okay, the next thing it, need, it tells us to do is actually to go to the Pokemon gym. However, before I do that, I'm just gonna grab uh, the item that is here, the leaf stone, and then we've got a Pokemon to catch. Gonna go do some fishing. There, there's only one Pokemon to catch, and that is a Basculin. And uh, the... Gumi, can you wake up, please? You might be collecting me some uh, punch bags. Um, the Basculin that you get um, is determined by which game you're playing. So, because we're playing Y, we'll get the Red Stripe one. Um, we do have to use the Good Rod for us. And it's a common... Uh, I think it's like 35% chance of catching it, or 40 or something like that. Um, so we should she should get it quite quickly. Let's have a look. What is it actually? It is 35. I was right the first time. Gumi, please just be able to run away. Gumi will actually um, evolve next level. So, so actually, I say it's quite good that we uh, didn't have an extra. Um. Uh, rare candy because then it would be Silagoo and it wouldn't have got me the Pokedoll but I had Floor Baby in the party anyway so it really didn't matter come on get a Pokemon already Gumi is very happy down there look at it really I can't even surf to like get this into a good position for uh, fishing wow this is not going well right now not going well at all. <laughs> okay. Finally. Come on, please be basculine this time. No, it's Poliwell again.
certainly not going to be doing any chain fishing here right now. <coughs> Excuse me. Need a sticky old Pokemon. Finally. Okay, Basculin, please. Basculin, please. Basculin, please. Basculin, please. No, Bollywood, leave me alone. We don't want you, we want Basculin. Stop body slamming me. Thank you. I just realized, did I... What did I say in my announcement? Oh no, they, yeah, okay, I did, I did do it right, 5th and 6th. I, I just had a moment of, like, not panic, but thought that I maybe put 4th and 5th gym badges. So, like, got the 4th last time and going to get 5th today, but that was yesterday. <laughs> we got the 5th and are going to get 6th today. We haven't actually got too, too much left to do in this game. We've got a little bit, there's still a bit to do, but not... Not a whole lot, lot to do. Bollywell, go away. I know you're 65% chance of finding you, but please, show me something else. Wait a sec. What? It says with the good rod, Pollywell. Never mind. This is the. Pollywell is the 35% chance to find. Basculin is the 65%. Why are we only finding Pollywells? I was looking at it the wrong way around. It's super rod the other way, like the other way around. It's uh, for the super rod. So, Poliwell is 65, and Basculin is 35 with the super rod. Finally, but I'm using the good rod, which is 65 Basculin, 35 Poliwell. Do I think? I, I don't think a Dragon Breath will kill. And it has the a chance to paralyze. Paralyze. Oh. That was almost I didn't why didn't I use a quick ball? Why do I also get the right quick balls? Oh well, never mind. Go on, just catch. Go on, do it. Catch for me, please. Sorry, Gumi. <laughs> I thought I was gonna be able to catch it, to be honest. And you're not affectionate to me, so you can't just randomly survive on one HPs like the others can. Oops. Come on, really? There we go, finally. Finally caught the basculin. Okay, let's go heal and then we'll go into the gym for our next gym challenge. Okay, right. I'm just going to grab the uh, gym layout and stuff because I know this one's a bit of a weird one. So what I want to, what I like to do with this is have it so I can draw on it, so I can cross out when I go to each room. So 
It's a tree house. It's pretty cool. A, a sort of tree house. It's a house with a tree. It's not up the tree. Okay. Well, howdy, Mr. Palty. Okay. What's new, future champ? This here... This here Lavere City Pokemon Gym has some truly confounding conundrums. The first shocker is this here is a fairy type gym. Bet you've never seen one of these before. The second shocker is how you get around. Hop on one of the warp panels and off you go. But where will you land? Nobody knows! Ha! Just pulling your leg champ. The warp panels all have fixed destinations of course. So go on. Step on a flashing yellow panel. Why not this green one? Oh, okay. Fair enough. Okay, so I can immediately cross off the first place. Um, and we've gone to the middle room. Is there anyone in the middle room? Aha, there is. Hello. I I just realized this is a fairy type game and I've got a dragon up front. That's probably not a good idea. You know, I always forget that Dedenne is a fairy type. I always think it's just pure electric. Okay, we'll switch. Go, go. You can uh, deal with this. <gasps> it boosted its special attack. My moves are all in different places. Volt switch? Oh, well, that's a bit annoying. What's our other Pokemon? Azumarill? Okay, I'm fine with that too. I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay. All in each, we'll get our health back. Thank you. Dodge. Cool. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go in this one. Maybe I should... Oh, you know what? You know what? That's a good idea. I should cross off the panels I go in or come out of not not the rooms but the actual panels uh, that's this one here is there a trainer in here? no oh I'm back at the beginning okay so we'll go back on this one because we can go Onto this one. Still no trainer in this one. That comes to this one. No trainer here either. Can't actually see that panel on the. Uh, thing. Uh, that's this one. There is a trainer in this room. A Klefki? Hmm. hmm. Steel Fairy. I'm going to use Delphox this time. I just noticed something. My poster, my Detective Pikachu poster has fallen down. I'm going to have to pop that back up again. I'll just do this fight and then I'll uh, put it back up. Well done, Delphox. A Gramble? So that's just pure fairy. I don't have anything for pure fairies. We'll just stay in this Delphox, then. Eh? 
Oop, Gumi's level 40. Which means he's going to evolve. And a Curlia. What's there? Oh. I forgot I moved all my moves around. I'm a fire type? I mean, I guess I just did the same thing. I used a fire type move on a Pokemon that resists it. Coco, it's level 54. Oh, I forgot my O powers. Okay, I'll make sure to use after this. Gumi is evolving. I have to flip this one around. There we go. Cool. Okay. So, let's use that one and that goes to here. Okay. Let me, uh, use my O power. Prize money at number two. Schlupuff. Okay, so you're still no good against fairies, so... We're switching. Um, we'll go to Delphox again. We'll just flamethrow you. Cooking that marshmallow. That's what we just did. We roasted our marsh marshmallow. be here yet. I haven't been on all the warp panels. Backtrack. I don't know whether there's a trainer in... I haven't been into our room completely. I don't know whether there's a trainer in it or not. If there's not, that's fine. There is. Look, I'd have missed out on this trainer if I hadn't come here. And I wouldn't want to do that now, would I? Whoa. It has a cool noise to it. Okay, Del Fox, I believe in you. You don't actually love her. Love her. Come on. Thank you. <gasps> Survived? Really doesn't actually love her. Good. Excellent job. Well done. Sunny day? I mean, that would be quite useful, but no. We don't need it. Okay, we can head back now.
I'm just going to quickly switch my team order and I'm just going to stick Delphox at the front. I don't have anyone specifically that's good for this gym. Ah, oh, my prize money power. Hope I'll run out. Oh, I'll just have to use another one. Okay, let's do this. Oh, nice cutsy. Oh, if it isn't a young trainer. So you've flown all the way through my gym, fluttering down to me on a fortunate wind. Then I suppose you have earned yourself the right to, to a battle as a reward for your efforts. I am Valerie, who leads this fairy type gym. I hope your visit will prove entertaining to me, to you. Okay. The elusive fairy types may appear frail as a breeze and delicate as a bloom, but they are strong, if you say so. To be fair, I use Xerneas in my other play, my X playthrough, and it's very good. More well, I picked the right start. That was good. I picked the right one. Flamethrower! Goodbye. <laughs> Sylveon. Pure fairy. I don't, like I say, have anything for fairy types, so I'm just gonna stay in and flamethrower again. level up for Sligu and Aurorus. Mr. Mime. So this is Psychic Fairy. We'll stay. Two eyes is... Oh, no, it's probably especially bulky in it. Let's, uh, let's Thief. Okay, that didn't do very much. What screen did it just use? Light screen, okay. If it had used Reflect, I would have stopped using Thief. I'm a Psychic type? <laughs> That's not going to do anything. Ah, I didn't know whether it actually put her in heal range or not. Clearly it did. You know, you could just get a crit, Del Fox. Or not. Okay. How many times will she heal? Will she heal more than once? Yep. Maybe I should just flame her. Oh no, because light screen. Could mean I burn though. Could get a burn. Light screen has worn off now. Yep, yeah, probably should have just done that from the first point. <laughs> oh well. I hope the sun is shining tomorrow. That would be reason enough to smile. Okay. Yes, that was a fine battle. I shall reward you for this great victory. This is the fairy badge. It is yours now. Its beauty is captivating, is it not? Ah, do forgive me. I was so captivated, I forgot for a moment that it is yours. Woo! Gym badge number six. It's so small. Look how small it is down there. <laughs> this captivating fairy badge will endeavor, no, endear any Pokemon up to level 80 to you. Yes, even those Pokemon that you may receive from others will obey you. I also wish to award you this TM. Please consider it a personal gift from me, not simply by the winning of, this, of a battle. Thank you. Dazzling Gleam. Oh, my, what a curious feeling. I can't seem to recall any longer which move is contained in that TM. I hope you may forgive me. My designs are said to be rather mystifying. Do you agree with that? I've always wanted to be a Pokemon, you see. 
That desire is my inspiration and what I try to achieve by designing. And yet, the only time I feel I am truly one with Pokemon is when we are embroidered in desperate battle. I wonder why that is. Mm -hmm. Could it be? Never mind. It is nothing, kind tra trainer. Okay. Um, Dazzling Gleam is what she just gave me. I'm just going to check to see if anyone on my team can learn it. No. <laughs> no one on my team can learn it. Okay. Oh. Um, sort my team out quickly. Put, put everyone back into their places. And take this. Take the honey. Okay, cool. So. Um, I think if we stand on this one, we can go back to the entrance. Yep. Excellent. Hi, crazy. Hey, that's the fairy badge. It's so cute and sparkly. You know what? We're going to, we're going to go tour the Pokeball factory. Come with us. I'm tr interested in Pokeballs because they're used to catch Pokemon. To put it another way, I'm utterly fascinated by them. Okay, I will join you in one moment. I'm just going to go heal up my team because Delphox took a beating. Delphox was the only one in that fight. Okay, good. Let's go meet them. Okay, there are actually some items to get here. Let us in. You'll see. I'll go talk to him again. Who? Shauna! Wait! <clears throat> oh, hello. Did Shawnee and Trevs go running off just now? What's the deal? We were supposed to meet here, too. I wonder what the matter is. Eek! <clears throat> Shawnee! Wait! Stop! going on? Well, I guess I'll go help them. Team Flare? There might be something happening inside. Let's check it out while the guard is gone. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Let's go into these head ma hedge mazes. For the Pokeball. rain. Uh, Max Ether. And my favorite type of Pokeball, the Dusk Ball.
Okay, there is actually a second hedge maze on the other side, so we're gonna go over here as well. We can head on in now. Out of the rain. Can't that idiot outside ev even handle a duty guard? What? Guard duty? So sorry, but we're not offering tours right now. With a red suit like that, you must be a member of Team Flair, right? Did you have to take a part-time job at the Pokeball Factory to pay for that ugly suit. What? How dare you mock Team Flair? My Diana, get them! I'll take care of this. You go on ahead. Okay. Hmm. Oops. Oh, I should be using my open. I might not be able to use my open power at the moment. Anymore. Okay, okay Slagoo. So see what you can do. It's level 36, so you're a bit higher. Let's, uh, let's get a Dragon Breath in here. Not too bad. Did he just swag at me? Yeah, it just swag at me. I don't have any physical moves. Shake it off. Thank you. Oh, I should have used Aurorus actually. Because Aurorus needs training, whereas Delphox doesn't right now. Delphox is ahead of everyone else in terms of the bracket of levels he's in. Oh well. Too late now. I've I've done it. I've clicked the the uh, Pokemon. No, don't go on there yet. To go pick up this item. The quick ball. I actually forgot to pick up that uh, quick ball in my other playthrough. Uh, I had to go like all the way around and try and reverse the uh, um, conveyor belts to actually get it. Don't worry, be happy. Okay, I for forgot to check my... Um, Oh, powers. Oh. Never mind. Excuse me. Yeah, you sit down. Going? No. No. 
No! <laughs> Thank you. I want the timer ball. You can see a giant, like, hole of Pokeballs here. It's pretty cool. This is actually where you can reverse the uh, conveyor belt. Which can be useful. I don't need to do it right now, but we'll need to do it when we leave. Do Does one of you heal me? Is it you? Do you heal me? Yes. Thank you! Oh, well, do I have to... Actually, I have to reverse them so I can get to the other side, don't I? Yes, 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 yes. I remember now. Because this person is blocking my way. Mm, dragon mode. <gasps> the paralysis. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. That helps special defense, right? Toxic? How dare you. Excuse me. Cool, modern slagoon. Everyone's getting level ups. Okay, not everyone. Half my team. Let me just go heal up, seeing as it's right here. How do I get there? Oh, I see how to get there. I do have to do some reversing. Because I need to get over here. I already fought her. But I haven't fought this guy. Toxic rope? Okay. Especially bulky, so that shouldn't do too much yet. <clears throat> Go goes level fifty five. Muscle and Leaf Blade. Hmm. Ninety and crits. You know what? That's better than seed bomb. It probably is better than horn leech now because it's what fifteen power more, rather opposed to five, and potentially could do. Um, what, 135? Because it's 1.5 times. Okay, before I head on here, I just need to BRB for a quick moment, so I'll be right back.
Okay, sorry about that. I'm back though. Okay. Now I am actually expect expecting a delivery. So I'm just going to get the, see if it's, the tracker's working right yet. I'm getting some new headphones, like over ear ones. It says by end, by end of day today, basically. It left the. It left the like distribution center, I guess. At 10 to 8, so 10 minutes before I start streaming. <laughs> it's a very late, late departure time, really, isn't it? Oh. You'll get here, I guess. Hopefully today. That'll be good. Can test them out. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, okay. Let's head on in. Oh, I didn't use my O power. Oh, well. Come now. Work with Team Flare. Well, work for Team Flare, sorry. If you'd just help out, we wouldn't have to carry all these Pokeballs by ourselves. Or, with a contribution of just 5 million Poke Dollars, you could become a member of Team Flare. It's a no-brainer. What in the world are you, are you Team Flare fools thinking? I'll never forgive any group that tries to take all the Pokeballs for itself. Forget it. Quit wasting your time with this person. I agree. There's no one we can use here. There's no one we can use here. Let's blow this place to smithereens. Well, what do we have here? An intruder? You're one to talk. You, please, help me. Oh, my. Oh, my, oh, my. Getting a little desperate, are we, Mr. Company President? Well, I guess I'll have to extinguish your little glimmer of hope. And that's what you think. Admin? Yeah. It's the female admin. The male admin is the bold one. You have a scraggy. Okay. And Dragon Breath. Found Doom. Oh, I, I wanted to switch. Oh, well, no way. Accidentally stayed in. Let's muddy water. Oh, it, it is loosed. Excellent. That worked quite, quite well, actually. Well done, Slugu. What? What? Come on! You didn't have to go all out for a pitiful president like him. So lame. That's just embarrassing from an admin. Still, no worries. We're on it. This pair of scientists will clean up after you. Let's take 
him on two versus one. We must improve our chances of winning. We'll see about that. Sorry I'm late. There's another one? One kid or two? It doesn't make a lot of difference. When we're the ones fighting together, our odds of victory increase exponentially. You might want to check your numbers. Are you really even scientists? Can you help me fight them, neighbor? Yes. Let's go! Let's do this. Manetric and Lipard. Now I am quite hurt right now, so I'm gonna switch. Um, I'm thinking we switch to Go Go, because I have super effective moves for both of these Pokemon. I feel like Meowstic might get hit by a, dark, a couple of dark type moves. Oh no, I got hit by a dark type move. Hmm, okay. Fair enough. Um, I, I'm going to go for uh, Rock Smash on the Lipod. You attack the Manetric, okay? Never mind. You're going down. <laughs> Well done, go go. An Absol. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Oh, well, Absol did actually survive, so it's all good. You've got an itchy foot. <laughs> itchy foot. Good work, team. No way. Wow. We are lame. Probability is just probability, after all. Absolutes do not exist. Oh my, oh my. So lame. What a shame. We got beat. Enough already. We've got already stolen the Pokeballs, Great Balls, and Ultra Balls. Let's call it good and leave. No? Oh dear. You saved us. Thank you so much. You're astounding, Pokemon trainers, for being so young. Very well then. I want to show my appreciation. I'll give you a Master Ball or a Big Nugget. Pick whichever one you'd like. I think you should pick first. I'll give you a Master Ball or a Big Nugget, whichever one. Pick whichever one you'd like. Uh, Master Ball, please. And here you go. I got a Master Ball. And as a bonus, you can have the one you didn't pick as well. <laughs> Why ask me then? Why not just go here? Have these two items. Completely pointless. Oh well. And for you, too, of course. So, thank you. This seems like a lot. It is. I just have a feeling you two will put them to great use. Uh-huh. One of, them, one of them, maybe. One of them, maybe. You're different from those Team Flare people. Oh, and even I don't know the proper way to use a big nugget. Uh, sell it for a lot of money. Still, that blasted Team Flare. What, are, what were they planning to accomplish by taking all the Pokeballs for themselves? Hmm, good question. But yes, the item that I will actually use is the big nugget by selling it. The item I will not use is a Master Ball. I very, very, very rarely ever use a Master Ball in Pokemon. Like, yes, I'll use it on a Shiny if I'm desperately needing to. Hey, do you think it's okay okay to go have a look around now? I'm sorry, Team Flare messed everything up. It's not a good time right now. Team Flare? Have I heard that name somewhere? Would they be the people in the red suits from a minute ago? That's right, Trevor, Team Flare. They took all of the Pokeballs for, by force, but they're for everybody to use. How awful. It seems like it would be best not to get involved with those guys. You're right, Trevs. Team Flare sure is trouble terrible. What should we do now? According to the town map, Dendermill Town is next. Oh, bye. Crazy. You and Shauna are really awesome. You're way stronger than those bad guys. Still, try not to do anything crazy, okay? See ya! But that's my name. Yeah, 
Thank you. Everyone's okay, thanks to you. But if I keep relying on you like this, going on this journey will lose its meaning. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Oh. Hollow clip. Oh. Ah, the news. We're bringing you this special bulletin. The Pokeball factory in the area around Lavir City has been attacked. The identities of those involved are unknown. However, it is not expected to have any effect on the sales of Pokeballs. Okay. Oh, I just remembered. Um, Coco is now at the level where it's not meant to be there anymore. Okay. Okay, let's go heal up and then we can move on out of here to the next area. Which, if memory serves me correctly, is where we get our next Pokemon. Yes, it is. Hmm. <laughs> Great. It's a, it's a rare encounter. <laughs> so it's a 5%. <laughs> um, is it, like, less rare in other places? Okay, yes, it is. If that's fine, okay. We can, uh... We can get it from a slightly further on than the original place. That's fine, okay. Oops. Wait, what are you doing here? Man, these red suits are hard to run in. I'll never catch up those, to those kids, but the admins are sure gonna be grumpy about this. Yeah, I mean, they all left. They're not there anymore. Okay. Thank you. This does mean I'm gonna be losing, um, uh, Combi from my party shortly. Sorry, give me one sec. Uh, okay, so. New route, new Pokemon. So. Those new Pokemon are Mightyena, uh, Scorupi is not new, um, oh wait, no, sorry, not Mightyena, Mightyena is X only, we are playing Y, uh, Lipard is the one we can get, uh, Fungus is new here, Uh, Watch Hog. Hornyard. And Klefki. Which is actually the uh, Pokemon that we are going to be adding to the team. Okay, Hordes, we can get Murkrow, Fungus, or Klefki. Still 5% though. Surfin, we can get Lombre and Floatzel. And then Fishing, uh, nothing new. Uh, 
uh, and then items. It's quite a lot of items. There's some items I can't get right now because we don't have multiple. Five, that four, leather berry. Let's uh let's get going. Oh yeah, it's the leafy area. Oh, there's a ninja. Not actually a ninja, but you know. Acts like a ninja. Quagsire? Shame I don't have a grass type move. Um, let's just Dragon Breath. <gasps> the Paralysis! Oh. Trying to put me to sleep. Probably will succeed too. Excellent. Good job, Sligoo. And now you're sleeping. <laughs> A bear tick? Uh, let's use our fire type. Fifty-four. Come on. Okay, I need to wake Sligoo up now before we go into another fight because it's just annoying otherwise. There we go. There's a revive under those leaves. Oh, a netball. Nothing under that one. There's a trainer here, I think. Yep. Echo. Ah, just Dragon Breath again. Wow, that did a lot of damage. I like the little cry from Chimeco. It's nice. Slugoo's level 44. I completely missed that I could jump here. Love a berry. I thought it was uh, the other way only, but clearly I was wrong. And do Oh, 
Oh, there's another trainer. A watchdog. <gasps> Another paralysis. Good work. Oh, it broke through. Stats changed. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. Uh, Swoobat. Um, we'll go to Aurorus. Super effective with Aurorus. It's a flying type. Seedra. Let's get Gogo -Go in here. This thing's not quite a dragon just yet. I'm gonna try a leaf blade. Hmm. Yes, forgot about that. Nice level up. Well done, Go Goat. No, you do not need Fury Pipes. We still haven't actually taught its strength yet. No, we'll need to do that soon, actually. We need strength on this route. Okay, let me heal again. Ooh, Combi's picked up some more uh, honey for me. Uh, that's pretty decent there. Uh, antidote. I need to keep picking up the honey from uh, Combi because we are going to be losing Combi soon. So I uh, want to collect as much honey as we can get so that we can still do hordes even without Combi. Yeah. We might have to just go pick up Combi every, like, when we want to do the horde parts of uh, the routes, but it's fine. Oh, excellent! That's perfect! That's the Pokemon I wanted to find. 5% as well, I'm pretty confident. I'm pretty sure that's a 5% here on this route. Pretty sure you're 5% here. It says, it says rare, which normally means 5%. Oh no, it's 10% okay. the case. Not as hard to find as I first thought, but still. I, it must be very rare is um, 5%. Oh, can we just leveled up as well? Okay, we'll go pick up that Klefki, because that is part of our team. Again, I will do the um, EV training um, off stream. Also, that Klefki does not count towards the living decks as well. We do need to find another one as well. Um, but yeah, I'll uh, I'll do the uh, EV training, super training stuff between this stream and next. Uh, and if I have time, I'll do the affection stuff for both Sligu and Klefki, but that will take... That's not as a high priority as doing the super training, because the EVs and stuff are a bit more annoying if I don't do them fully first. Okay, I'm actually going to... Oh, wait, you know what I need to do? We have our shiny uh, Nidoran here. We need to grab the shiny um, Skorupi that I got last time as well. I'm going to put um, Combi here just so I can find it again quite easily uh, when it comes to needing uh, something for horde hunting. As in, for the Pokemon Notch, for the shiny hunting. Uh, you're level 34, so you are going to need to be at the front of the party. We'll go through move sets and stuff in a sec as well. That's not what I wanted to do. No, what else I need? Also, I need to do. I need to do that. Add Clefki to the layout. Okay, move the lucky egg to there. 
And then Slagoo needs an item. What item do we have for Slagoo? I don't think we have any dragon related items just yet. So it might be... Um, might be... Ooh, I could give you the Eevee Light for now. Yeah, we'll do that. Give you an Eevee Light and then we'll give you leftovers once you uh, evolve. That sounds good. Okay. So let me have a look at the TMs that we have now. So uh, I don't care for any of these. Oh, I need to... First things first, I need to see if you're a physical or a special attacker. You are mixed. Okay, so just the best of whatever. Um, for my... You are actually quite defensive. But for my EV training, I'll probably do attack and special attack as the EV training, to be honest. What on earth is Crafty Shield? Oh, okay, that's pretty terrible. Okay. Let's see what TMs we've got. For you. Uh, not much, apparently. Glad we got the Thousand Gleam, because you don't have a actual attacking fairy type move. You have a, a steel type move. Okay, the fact that you have a non-attacking move, I'm going to give you um, return as well. Because we don't need torment, so might as well give you return. Okay, and now we'll just go through and reorganize your moveset. So Dazzling Gleam can be number one, Mirror Shock can be number two, Foul Play can be number three. Cool. Foul Play is the one that uses the opponent's... Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, it uses the opponent's attack stand rather than your own. Which is kind of annoying. Um, okay, so... Um, with that, let's uh, get back out there. It's raining. Oh, well now would be a perfect time for Slagoo Slug to get to level four, uh, 50, sorry. Because it would evolve into Gudra. Oh, that's the trainer. Oh, this is perfectly timed. Dazzling Gleam. Oh, you're level 41. Right. I assume I don't have Levitate. Just by not being on the floor. Prankster gives a priority to a status, status move. Huh, interesting. That's not going to come in handy for me. Um, okay, let's just go to Auroras. I know this is super effective, but... Aurorus is four times effective against uh, God Gabite. Haha, <laughs> good dodge. See, Klepki couldn't have done that because not affectionate. Oh. A bit annoying. You're faster than me. Didn't miss this time. Cool. Well done, Aurorus. the water here. It's a lombre. Okay, we want to try and catch this thing, so I'm going to throw a quick ball. Where are my quick balls gone? Where are my quick balls? Oh, there.
Yay. Caught the Lombre. Somebody got to level 45. I'm not sure who. I guess it was, might have been Slugu. Oh, I don't want to nickname it. No nicknames here. That's the trainer. Pedro with a vile plume. Okay, grass poison. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna go to Aurora's because it's raining. So, uh. Flamethrower won't do that much. Well, I say it won't do that much. It won't do as much as Aurora Beam here. Paralyzing me? Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Nice. Not paralyzed anymore. Level 55 for Aurora's now as well. Left key's level 35. <laughs> oh, uh, Lanoon has got a... Whoops. Item for me. Let's get that. Oh, that's cut. That's not what I wanted to do. Fully here. Okay, cool. Okay, so there's also an item under this. Dire hit. Thank you, go, go. What wild Pokemon is it going to be? A Lipard. level up for Klefki as well. I don't need a prison, thank you. That was pretty cool. Got me a full heal. Hop back. Another wild Pokemon. Is it going to be something new? Or is it going to be Lipard again? <gasps> it's another Klefki. I'll take that. Klefki, meet Klefki. Wait, it's level 35 already. Mine wasn't that level. Actually, was it? I don't actually remember what level my Klefki was now. I don't know whether it's leveled up once or twice. Oh. Okay. Um, 
Let's just use return. That won't kill. Now I can't use the same move twice. Oh, that did nothing. Okay, let's try a mirror shot. Is neutral. Lowered accuracy. Interesting. Didn't realize mirror shot did that. Some other time. Oh, stupid, tor stupid torment. Okay, and then the mirror shot now should get it down to red, I would have thought. Or not. Accuracy drop again, though. I, that's excellent. I'm just going to return again, just because I can. Okay. Might try my, uh, Dusk Ball. Wherever it is. There it is. Got ourselves a cleft key. To the decks. Because we already had one. We're over 20% of the decks done now. One fifth of the way through. Pretty good. We have 146 Pokemon for the deck, living decks. Um, yeah, let's do this double battle. A Drifblim and a Floette. Interesting. Okay, we should be good for this fight, though. As I can use a Mirror Shot on Floette. And a Thunderbolt on a Drifblim. Oh, so close. A special defense is so good. Well, that really didn't do very much. <laughs> Thank you. No, it does attack though. That's kind of annoying because I'm a special attacker. Oh well. Does this thing have aftermath? Oh, it had barely any HP actually. So even if it does, it won't do that much to me. It didn't. Is that a crit? It was. That was a double crit to finish that fight. Because Slugu got a crit as well. Even though the Drift Rim, like had 1 HP, so it didn't really matter. But still got a crit. Okay, so... Um, there's another Rock Smash here. I don't think we really need to worry about the Rock Smash here, because this is just how you get to the Waterfall, and I can't do that. We don't have Waterfall. Um, is there a need to surf down here? There is, okay. Maybe. Oh yeah, there is. Pretty weird. There's a TM over here on the other side of those rocks, but I can't get to them from this route. I have to get them from the next route. But I think you need Waterfall to get to them as well, to, to it, to be fair as well. Can I... I think there's a hollow clip on the bridge. But can I skip it by doing that? Oh no, okay. Slysander. According to Professor Sycamore's research, Mega Evolution releases all of a Pokemon's hidden energy at once. The Pokemon that exhibits a level of power it could not attain through ordinary evolution. What meaning can we draw from this? Do all pe people and Pokemon have such potential? Or is it hidden within a chosen few. I don't know, Lysander. That was a very random phone call, but thanks. Oh, I think that's on top of the cliff. I, I can't get to it at the moment. Because you need waterfall to get up there. Oh, it actually might be up the stairs there, actually. Thinking about it. 
I don't know, I think there's two hidden items around here that I'm probably folk, like get, picking up. But I can only get to one of them at the moment. Oh, hello. Come here. You have fairy types? Well, I have a steel. And fairy. But steel is what I'm going to be using here. Volt switch. He's the Dene like switching out, but you're probably going into another fairy? Yeah, aromatis. Okay. Oh wow, that really didn't do very much. I missed. Okay, I need to heal. Um I do need to BRB quickly though, so I'll be right back. Sorry. Enjoy the battle music.
I'm back. Sorry about that. Okay, so uh, we're gonna want to heal because otherwise aromatis will just take me out right now. Um, so I'm gonna probably soda pop. I don't need to go over the top with my healing. Okay, mirror shot again. Oh, I'm in love. Great. Ah, broke through. Well done, Klefki. And a crit. Excellent. Well done. Level up to go with it too. Uh, back to Dedenne, we will stay in. You can Volt Switch all you like this time, Dedenne. Oh no, Charge Beaming. Special attack rise, but hopefully we can do a good damage, amount of damage with this. Another crit? Wow, did it, uh, Klefki is full of these critical hits right now. Why are you sleeping? Are you holding a Chesterberry? Nope. Okay. Sleep, little mouse, sleep. I only have one mirror shot left. Perfectly timed crit again! Good work, Klefki. Nearly a level up as well. That was a good first little few fights there, Klefki. Well done. However, you have run out of mirror shots now, though. Which is kind of annoying. Okay, we've actually come to the end of the route. Um, there is one more trainer and one more item. And then we can catch some Pokemon before heading down into the Lost Hotel. Which is where I thought I was going to have to get Klefki. But, well... We got it before. <laughs> so that's good. Um, hmm. Do I stay in and foul play? Do I think this thing can hurt me that much? Probably not. I can't imagine foul play is going to do too much though because it's probably got a very good attack stat. Hmm. Okay, let's switch. Let us switch to our rock type. <laughs> Level 39. Good job. Duosion. I'm going to use Delphox because I have Thief. Wait, do I still have Thief? Yeah, I do. I didn't get rid of Thief or anything, did I? Oh, excellent. Well done, Delphox. I might just quickly pop into um, Dendermill Town just to heal. Um, might be worth doing. I think Dexio and Sinnoh might stop me here, but it's fine. Oh no, they didn't. Just a pit stop. We are heading back out there again. Just only pick up that last item and then catch a few Pokemon. So, let me have a look. Where is it best for us to catch these Pokemon? So, um, Fungus is 20%, 20%, so that's fine. To be fair, it's 35% in hordes. 
uh, Watchog. 10% or 30%. So Red Flowers is better for Watchog. And Pawnyard is 20 or 10. So Red Flowers is where we want to be, really. Okay, we can't get that. It's on that rock up there. I can't get to it, so we won't worry about that item. Okay, so Red Flowers for Fingers, Watchog, and Pawnyard. There's the Watchog. Now, if we... If we get... Well, Watchog. <laughs> this one here. Um, but if we get... Um... Pawnyard before Fungus, we will just get Fungus from Hordes because it's a slightly higher chance of finding it. It's a horde of Murkrow. <laughs> it's, it's the horde, hunt, the horde um, that I needed. Uh, oh, that hits all of them. Ooh. Don't want to hit all of them because it will just kill them all. <laughs> That's not what we want. I want to catch one of them. They shouldn't really be able to do anything to me. They're only level 18, and I resist most of their attacks. I resist both their stabs as well. Probably we'll get a level up from this, which is pretty cool. try one of my premier balls because I have so many of them yeah, that didn't work back to the ultra balls shall I master ball it I'm definitely not master balling it doesn't want to even shake but I can't really attack it because my Pokemon are too high a level None of them have full swipe. Poor Klafsky keeps getting pursued. This, this little bird really doesn't want to stay in the vocal, does it? Send myself a capture of power. From my other BS. I have a capture power. This should help me. Not. <laughs> ah, 
such a shaking. Oh. Uh, do I have some? I, I think I have timer balls. Where are my timer balls? Let's use these. Really? This this Mokra is going to actually eventually take out Klefki before I catch it. Come on, Murkrow. This Murkrow is ridiculous. Just really doesn't want to stay in this Pokeball. Finally. Wow. That took a lot longer than it should have. And Klefki grew to level 40. Uh, no, we do not need recycle. Thank you. Good goes level 40, uh, 57. Um, did Sligu already get to 45? I'm not actually sure. So that means Klefki still needs to be up front. Okay. So, let's keep going. We've got three more Pokemon to find. Only two in the grass, but... That's not one of them. Oh, I can't escape. There's the Fungus, which means we don't need to do any hordes, which is kind of good because I don't have uh, comb beat with me anymore, so I'd have had to use honey, but now I don't, so good. So now we just need to find Ponyard, then go surfing for Floatzel. Um, I'm actually going to put the Capture Power on myself to try and boost it as well. It'll be good. It's another 10% Clefki to find. Why am I getting all the 10%s? Only added 20%. Come on, let me find that. There it is. Actually makes it 150 Pokemon caught for the living decks now, which is pretty cool. Once we get Floatzel, we'll have a uh, Gen 1 living decks. 
equivalent. <laughs> Amount of Pokemon, anyway. Okay, I need to go to the water because I need to do some surfing. It is... Oh. 34% uh, chance to see the Floatzel. If at all. If anything. Come on. Thank you. There it is. There's the Floatzel. Critical capture! Go. Cool. Nice and easy. Floatzel was caught. That's 151 Pokemon for my living decks now. Okay, I'm going to go heal up at the uh, Pokemon Center. Uh, and then we will head into the Lost Hotel. We'll probably just do the Lost Hotel and end after that for today. To be honest. Because the next thing to do after Lost Hotel is Route 16, which is not the smallest of routes. Mr. Bonding's over there, but we're not going to go talk to him yet, because that's part of probably tomorrow's stream. Okay. Lost Hotel. So, let me... Get to the right bit here. Okay, so Pokemon that we can get here that are new. Magneton? No, sorry. Magnezone. No, what? It is Magneton. I don't know why I said Magnezone. Magneton. Electrode. Litwick. Uh, Ponyard and Clefkey we already obviously got. Um, and then... Trubbish. And... Garbodor. And if it was Tuesday, which it's not, we could potentially get Rotom. But it's not Tuesday. Uh, and then we've got some items as well. Ah, this is where we get the smoke ball. And Snarl as well. Um, I can't do the south side just yet because we can't we can't get it. Uh, oh, you know what? We will do the south side as well today. Just so then we complete the area. Okay, hey, my capture power wore off. That's fine. I'm surprised you can ride your bike down here, to be honest. Seems a bit weird. Okay, Scrafty. Ooh, Clefki is good for this fight. Four times effective. Switch 
Sharpedo? Go back to Klefki. That is resisted. This is super effective. And it didn't make contact, so no rough skin. Also learn Ice Beam, a yes please. Aurora Beam is 65. And this is 90. That's a great upgrade. Thank you. Yeah, I should probably put my uh, prize money power back on. It's a cleft key. It looks like all of the Pokemon here are 20% chance to find. They're all the same chance. It's a trash can. Let me put my other power back on. You a trainer? You are. You are a trainer. It's a viper? That's a poison type. That's not good for me. Well, actually, it's not bad. Because I'm actually immune to poison. Which is kind of good. But I can't really do much back to it. So I'm going to switch to Gogot, who has. Who is weak to poison, but has bulldoze, so can take him out quite easy. Oh, I should have gone to Delphox. Mm -hmm. That's super effective without. Well, I made the right choice because that's super effective against Delphox. But I could have used Psychic. Oh well, this works. This works. And I probably. Receive less, less damage because of it. Clefkey's level 42. Arbok, I will I will switch to Delphox this time. Because I'm not going into a dark time move this time. I'm just going to destroy it with Psychic. I move my TM. My, not my TMs. My moves around. I always forget, when I do that, for, like, for the first little while, I always forget that I moved them. It takes me a while to remember that where I put all my moves. Cool. Thank you. There's the smoke with my my rubber. Oh, we have a wild Pokemon. It's a Ponyard. <laughs> so the two Pokemon I've seen so far in here have been the two Pokemon I caught outside. Pangoro and Garbodo. Okay. How best to do this? I know definitely Dazzling Gleam. That hits both. Um, does Muddy Water hit both? Oh, it does. Oh, I missed. I missed both. Great. We got a crit and poison me. See a Pangora. I knew that wasn't going to do much to the Garbodor. Um, I'm going to have Mirror Shot and I'll just Dragon Breath to be honest. I'm a Steel type. Okay. 
Well, I actually did quite a lot. That did more than I thought it was going to do. What's your obsession with body slamming Klefki? Nice. Level 43. Wants to learn play rough. 90, 90. 80, We are a mixed attacker. Let's do my calculations. Okay. Okay. Well, with my power to accuracy ratio that I do, um, Dazzling Gleam gets a rating of 80, and uh, Play Rough actually gets a, a rating of 81. <laughs> so, it's slightly better. Super Rebel flew out the bin. Okay. Bit weird. Kind of hoping for a Pokemon, to be honest. Oh, hello. Dude, kid! What... What do you think... What do you think you're wearing? You ain't got no sense of style. You're getting about a million years ahead of yourself if you think you can meet the boss. What? What? But... I'm now really confused. I... I'm wearing the same clothes as I wore in my other game and I was able to go straight in. I mean, I, I took off my jacket. Is that the problem? Impress him with your roller skate tricks. If you learn to backflip and 360, he will let you continue... Oh, I... I didn't learn the 360? Where do I learn the three? Oh, I wish I'd done that. I, I didn't bother doing it because I was like, I don't really care about the roller skate stuff. I didn't. I thought it was about your style, as in like my style rating, which is maxed out. Okay, that's fine. We'll come back. Um, we'll come back. It's another Clefty. Okay, I'm gonna quickly. We're gonna quickly get back to Lumio City because I know where it is. I know. It's in one of the cafes in Lumio City. Oh, electrode. I, I won't do it today, um, but we will get the uh, skill, because we'll be heading back to uh, Lumio City soon. Oh, well, I guess no electrode for, for now then. That's not going to do much on the steel type. Okay, no more, no electrode. Yeah, I didn't realise it was tied to that. Oh, that's so annoying. I wish I'd realised. 
Okay, so we do want to briefly go on to Route 16. Oh, I need to... This is where I needed to teach. Um, strength to Linoon. I'm not going to do anything of Route 16s just yet. I'm just going to quickly pop in to uh, the Lost Hotel. Because we're now in the other section of the Lost Hotel. A dunce bass? You don't see many of them around. Try out our play rough. Oh, I missed. Let's try that again. Oh wow, that didn't do much. Okay, let's switch. You're paralyzing me? How dare you. There we go. Well done, go goat. Level up for Klefki. Let's learn the magic room, no thanks. Del Fox just tried to learn that as well. A bit weird. Red plate. Fling. Thanks. Ooh, a magneton. Nice. Ah, it's probably got magnet pull. <laughs> Which means we probably can't escape anyway, even if we wanted to now. Yay. We caught the magneton. It's a trash can. Oh, wild Pokemon. It's another Magneton. <laughs> ah, there's the Litwick. Now it's just... Um... Electrode. Hi, Power King. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Cool. Caught the lit wick. Ooh, yes. I would love to learn Dragon Pulse. 60, what's this? 90? 85. Nice. Okay, cool. We'll give that to Slagoo. What level is that? I, don't, I didn't actually see what level it was. 
You want some milk drink? <laughs> That's cool, but no thanks. Okay, um, I want to check. What level did... Ah, uh, 47, okay. So still a few levels off before we get to level 50. I need to find some rain. Stung, stung, a uh, skunk tank. Skunk tank is poison dark. But it will have flamethrower. Hmm. Hmm. Let's let's try out Slagoo. Let's uh let's use Slagoo's new move. Let's let's try out Dragon Pulse. Oh it didn't go it didn't go for flamethrower. Interesting. Lived on one HP. How rude. <laughs> Just take it out with the infestation. I have to. What? 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 Excuse me. You had like one HP. That should not have done that much damage to me. Clefki's level 45. Which means we actually want to switch Slugu to the front of the party again now. Crawdaunt. Um, let's actually go back to Klefki, because it's a dark type. So we can use Play Rough on it to do super effective damage. Excellent hit. Okay. Switch up the ordering of the team. Just like that, yeah. And then item move there. And item give. Um, we'll probably want to give you the metal coat to boost your steel type moves. Because play rough is better than mirror shot or whatever it is. Mir mirror shot? Yeah, that's what it's called. Hello, are you a trainer? You are. You are a trainer. A lipod. Just as we move away from our fairy type. That's fine. Sligu should be able to handle this quite easily anyway. Dragon balls. Bit annoying, but okay. A second light part. <laughs> okay, cleft gate. You can come back out. Looks level 59 now. There is the protector for when we want to get uh, Riparia, I think that is. I'm pretty sure that's Riparia. Are you a shaking bin? No. Okay. Okay, so we're actually done in the Lost Hotel for now. We do need to come back once we've learned the 360. I know I can do the backflip, um, but I need to be able to do a 360 to be able to go into that last little room. So we'll do that when we go back to Lumio City. Um, we'll uh, go to the cafe that teaches you that. Um, so for now... 
we just need to get electrode and I'm not going to worry about Trubbish and Garbodor because they're too awkward to get because you have to get them from the trash can shaking. And I'm not I'm not doing that right now. That's just not going to happen. So we'll uh, we'll find we'll find electrode. We'll catch all an electrode and then we will we'll head back to we'll, we'll, um, Dendermill. We'll uh, we'll end at Dendermill. We will be coming back to Route 16 afterwards though in, in next stream. before heading back to Dendermill again afterwards. <laughs> what a... I'm, I'm pretty, pretty, pretty confident they're all 20% chance to find the Pokemon in here. Yeah, they are. So hopefully it doesn't take too long to find the uh, electrode. Oh, I should put the uh, catching light power on as well. While I do this. So that when I find the electrode, I can catch it a little bit easier. don't have enough. Okay, I swapped my tight my, my Pokemon up front, so I can actually escape that now. Maybe. Yeah. Why is Electrode not a bearing? Come on, Electrode. Ah, there we go. There's the Electrode. in total in this game alone because I'm up to 154 in total most of them are in this game to be fair can I see like an overall is that I don't I think that's number seen rather than number caught isn't it does it say how many I've caught I've obtained oh no 62 is the amount of caught so why does, it, why does it go back all the way up? Why can't it just go back to the like, first part? So my total court, it... <laughs> Actually, is there any... I don't think there's overlap, overlaps. So, 150, uh, 157. Wait, that Oh, yes. Yeah, okay. I was going to say, that doesn't make any sense, but it does. Because I've got the Delphox line, Go Go, Aurora's line... Slagoo, all um, that are Pokemon that are not counting towards my living decks, 
but um, I've got in my decks here. So that's why it's more in this deck than I have in my living decks. Obviously, I will fill out those gaps when we finish by breeding and stuff like that. Okay. Seal up, and then we can... Ooh, we got the, the white shot. Hi, babe. How are you doing? I am just ending now, though. Okay. So... I will be back tomorrow at 8 p.m. UK time, or I should be, um, because I think tomorrow I am going to be going to a uh, like a a card shop. Like I don't really know how to describe it. It's a place that sells like trading cards, but they also put on events and stuff. Um, I'm going there to um, sell some of my uh, duplicate Pokemon cards that I don't want. Um, so I'm going to do that after work. And hopefully I'm back in time to stream. I should be, I would have thought. Um, hopefully it doesn't take too long. I'm good, thanks. Um, so in theory I should be back. Um, for 8 o'clock. Um, so um, if I'm not, there might not be a stream. We'll see. We'll, we'll see what, what time I get back and stuff like that. So um, as at the moment... There will be a stream tomorrow at 8 p.m. UK time, and we will be continuing this. So we are going to head down Route 16 back to Lumio City, um, pick up the ability to do 360 spins, come back to the Lost Hotel so we can go into that extra room as well, and then we'll be back at Dendermill as well to do some more stuff here. Um, but yeah, it's been fun. Thank you all for being here. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I've enjoyed it. I hope you guys have as well. And uh, I shall see you all in another stream. So thank you again and goodbye.